the Cottonwood County Citizen proudly presents Athlete of the Week. Sanborn Manufacturing, a division of Matt Industries LLC, is a leading manufacturer of air compressors, air tools, and accessories. Located along Highway 14 in Springfield, it's Sanborn Manufacturing. And I am joined right now by Comfrey Jr. Molly Carnell, our Athlete of the Week this week. Congratulations. Thank you. Well, let's go back to last Tuesday's game against Springfield. And, and uh, you know, you look at, at how the season has shaped up with all of the snow and all of the delays, and, and you finally got on the field. I can't imagine that you guys had been outside a whole lot prior to Tuesday. No, we were just out the day before on the field. Oh. <laughs> yeah, can't get much outside. Um, how how difficult has it been? How frustrating was it for you knowing that you guys are cooped inside day after day after day for a whole month? That kind of it's frustrating because you try and get your outfielders ready for pop ups and stuff. And it's hard to do inside because you can't get real height on the ball when you try to do pop ups. It's also difficult when you go finally go out and play on a game as a pitcher that's your first time with cleats on on the field so it's a little difficult going from tennis shoes to cleats and playing on a field with four games but uh you guys went up to springfield uh springfield in the past they've always been a pretty solid hitting team and uh you were able to keep them off balance uh what was working for you on tuesday um well my defense helped me a lot so uh and that's big, especially yeah. when you when you haven't been outside a whole lot. Yeah. Um, you know, uh, and and uh, when you've got good defenders playing behind you, that really helps you relax as a pitcher. Yeah, it does. It puts more confidence behind the pitcher because you know if even if they do get a hit, you got good defense behind you, going to help you get those out. Tell me a little bit about just the the dynamic. Um, you know, last last year you guys, uh, you know, entered a new pairing agreement with Mountain Lake. For for you, this is you know a, a little bit of an adjustment, uh, getting used to new girls, um, making new friends, um, getting to to know how um, players are playing behind you. Um, how how has that adjustment been? That adjustment has actually been very well. Um, uh, we blended really well right away. They very open, very nice to people, and so it just made the pairing that much better. So they they complimented each. What I mean by compliment is they would help you. Like as a pitcher, they would help me through it. Mm -hmm. Even if I'm having a rough spot where they're just hitting the crap out of me, they're behind me enough so where they are getting the outs for me so that I don't have to mm -hmm. depend on myself. And that's a bit of a transition too, because you know when when you guys were on your own, a lot of the burden kind of fell on you. And and uh, you know uh, when you were you know when you guys were still on your own, you're a pretty young player. Had to have been a lot of responsibility on you. Oh yeah, it was tough, but I made me better as a player and learned to trust my defense. As a pitcher, um, you know you've you've been a varsity pitcher for three, four years now, and um, what's been the biggest area of improvement for you in that time? Um, learning where to spot my pitches, um, and when I'm up in the count, learning when to throw them a jump ball, see if they'll go for it, or even a changeup, mm -hmm. trying to get them some off-speed pitches that they'll hopefully swing in just a little blooper where we can get it. Looking ahead, uh, you know, with the with the conference schedule this year being all double headers, uh, you don't have many non conference games left on the schedule. But when you when you go into the week knowing that you've got a couple of double headers, um, how are you able to to try to keep yourself as fresh as possible so you can give as many innings both games? Um, well, I do long warm ups, so I know that I'm ready to fresh for that game so I know that I I can make it um, 
I also don't do much other than that, other than ice after games, mm -hmm. making sure my arm doesn't get stiff and don't get that swelling and inflammation. You've got a, a pretty big section game on Friday, and it's up here on your home field. Um, I imagine that, that getting the chance to pitch in Comfrey means a little bit more for you. It means a lot, but I, I like pitching wherever. It's good feeling pitching here at Comfrey on the home field, but I like pitching wherever. Um, oh, last year we were playing against Cleveland, and we had a person on third and a person on second, and we had, I think it was two outs. And Brian Opwood, he come up to me, he said, you just got to hit it to the grass. I get up there, okay, Molly, calm down, it's just all right. I hit a home run, so it helped us win the game, which helped me quite a bit. Um, champion by Carrie Underwood. Edgerton. They are very, that team is very tough to play against and they're good competition. Goofy at times and serious when it comes to softball. I like to just be outside. I'm in 4-H so I like to be with my 4-H animals such as pigs and sheep. All right well that should be all I need. Uh, congratulations again. Best of luck the rest of the season. Thank you. Sanborn Manufacturing, a division of Matt Industries LLC, is a leading manufacturer of air compressors, air tools, and accessories. Located along Highway 14 in Springfield, it's Sanborn Manufacturing.